When you hear the term speed of the lens, that refers to the widest aperture, which is also your f-stop, your widest aperture or f-stop available on that particular lens. For example, Canon makes two different type of lenses, same zoom, they make a 24-70 f2.8 and they also make a 24-70 f4. Now you're going to pay more for the 2.8 because you have more light coming in that lens. I think that lens is about $1,750 uh, $1, for the 2.8. For the uh, uh, f4 lens, I think it's $900. So you're paying almost $1,000 extra for that uh, faster lens. They also make variable aperture lenses. I have a Canon 100 to 400 zoom. It has a 4.5 to 5.6 lens. When I'm zoomed to a 100, I have 4.5 available. When I zoom in to 400, it goes to 5.6. So I lose light there. Where can you find the speed of your particular lens? They have them printed right on the outside of, of lenses. Here I have three Canon lenses. Here I have a 100 to 400 zoom. This is a variable speed lens. It goes from 4.5 to 5.6. On this 24 to 105, the widest it goes is f4. And on this, on this 24 to 70, this one is printed on the inside of the lens. Right there, you can see it 24 to 70. That's a 2.8. Uh, this information is good to know when you're trying to plan a shoot that uh, doesn't have a whole lot of light. If you have the option, you always want to choose the faster lens. I appreciate you watching. If this has helped you, hit the subscribe button. Give me a like down below. Thank you. See you tomorrow.